One, two, three. Quinn's Neighborhood in Numbers. This is Quinn's Neighborhood in Numbers book. This is Quinn's house. It has one mailbox, one roof, and one front door. But Quinn's neighborhood has much more to explore. Can you help her count all the things she sees? Here we go. One, two, three. Quinn doesn't travel very far when she sees two cars, two houses, and two leafy trees. Quinn sees three dogs playing with sticks. Three dogs could give lots of puppy licks. How many big windows do you see? Can you find any more groups of three? One, two, three. One, two, three. Quinn turns and looks up at the sky. Four fine feathery birds are flying by. Also, five trees and flowers thrive. Count them, please. One, two, three, four, five. Six children slide in on the merry-go-round play. Quinn hopes to go back to the park and play too one day. Quinn's Park. Wow, what a fun surprise. Seven jungle animals, Quinn spies. If you can name them all, you are very wise. Add one more to seven, and you've got eight. Eight beautiful blossoms. Isn't that great? Nine children near the pond, each quacking like a duck. If you can count each duck, it may bring Quinn good luck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yes, counting the ducks did bring good luck. Quinn sees an ice cream truck. Count how many flavors are on the ice cream sign. If you counted to 10, you did just fine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Can you name 10 flavors? Which do you like best? Tasting them all could be a really fun test. Quinn had fun exploring her town in numbers from 1 to 10. Tomorrow she hopes you'll join her to explore all over again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Quinn, we hope you enjoyed this story. The end. Quinn, try one of our other personalized books at firsttimebooks.com.